Huh. Look at that. You know, it's been 94 days since I've even looked at a woman. And before this whole thing, man, like, this wouldn't have done nothing for me. But now, this is like basically hardcore porn. You know what I'm saying, Bizzle? Bizzle? Hello? Hello? Pizzle? Oh my god! Bezel! Bezel! What? What? Bezel, talk to me, what? I said I got you so good. <laughs> you look like a little bitch. No! Hello? Hey, dude. You might not have my stuff. All of it should be insured. Yeah, I got you. Hey man, glad you came in and uh, the secretary told me that you were having some reservations about that little job my boss gave you. I think it's important that during these trying times you remember, dude, we're the good guys. So it's okay. But you just asked me to murder 25 people. Ah, there's that word again, you know? PR told us that instead of people, we should call them scavs. What the hell's a scav? They're technically civilian combatants that are still within the conflict zone, just kind of mucking up our operations around here. So you want me to murder like a normal dude that's out there trying to feed his family? R wrong. 25 normal dudes. One? Are you kidding me? That's not very impressive. I could do that. I wouldn't pay you to do that. I could do that. And you're the good guys? You betcha. Look, we wouldn't ask you to do this unless it was really important. And uh, when you're doing it, we want you to use one of those little AKs. You know, like the little toy ones. Why? Because imagine you're a scav, you know, and this guy walks up to you, pulls out this little gun. It's like a, it looks like a toy. It's funny. But it's not a toy. Bingo. It's great because Prapor gets a giggle, you get a giggle, the guy gets a giggle before you shoot him. It's like a trifecta. You know, and out here in Tarkov, that's all we got left. That's what it's all about. Are you sure you're the good guys? Hey man, I got those 40 scab kills you wanted. Nice. All headshots, right? Hell yeah. Look at this picture. I got him when he was running away. Hell yeah. Jesus Christ. What time did we come here? I forgot the NVGs. See shit, where the fuck are we? Is this a minefield? What's he doing? It's a cultist, look at the way he's cutting the rug. <laughs> hey, mom. Yeah, I got broken into again. I'm sure of it. No, the door wasn't kicked in or nothing, but like all my canned food's missing. But who the fuck breaks in for a can of Sprats?
It doesn't make sense. And not only that, but like the, the door wasn't kicked in. So I'm like 99% sure these people had a fucking key. I gotta go. Hey, what's up, man? I'm Mike. I'm friendly. Hey, man. You mind uh, watching the hallway while I clear this place out? This is my apartment. That's my shit you're putting in your bag. Oh, you wanted some of this? Here, uh, take the cheese kit. Okay. I'm gonna stop you right there, because first of all, we both know the Tetris is worth far more than the cheese. Second, wh where did you get a key to my apartment? Oh, this? Yeah, I just got it from some dude on the flea market. The fl what the hell's the flea market? Did he tell you where he got it? I don't really bother asking. There are hundreds of them for sale. People were buying them up so fast. I just grabbed the first one I could. Hundreds of apartment keys? For this building? No, for this apartment. This is 303, right? Yeah, there's hundreds of keys. Basically, everybody has one. They just kind of leave them where they find them. Most people just find them in jackets hung around the city. They're basically everywhere. Wait, 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 wait. Back up, back up, back up. So you're telling me that not only are there thousands of keys to my apartment floating around, but now they're dispersed in all the hanging coats in the area, and hundreds of people armed to the teeth are going to be coming by all hours of the night just to steal my fucking canned food, knock my lamp on the floor, and possibly kill me? Well, yeah. If that's the case, you can have that Tetris then. Because, uh, I got other plans now. Wouldn't it be so fucking cool if we had that bag? All right, man, go get it. No, you go get it. No, you go get it. You're the one that fucking wants it. I don't want it. I'm the one who found it. Yeah, so you get the shit in it and you get to loot it. Go get it. No, if you bring it. It's out in the open. I'm not getting it. All right, fine. You, you crawl like a gremlin. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, you ever seen anyone shoot a gremlin? <laughs> Gremlins are endangered. They would never be <laughs> shot. <laughs> Let's eat that shit. Come on. I'll watch your back. What's taking so long, man? Hurry up. We got backpacks inside a backpack. What's taking so long? I don't know, this guy just has bags inside a bag. It's like Bagception over here. Whoa. What is it? It's beautiful. No, 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 Bizzle! I'm coming in, buddy! Don't stack bags. I'm warning you, man. What you just saw was a true story. That actually happened. So don't stack them, okay? It's not because I'm mildly inconvenienced by having to open bag after bag after bag to get to your loot. It's because if you stack too many bags, they might suck you in and kill you. So don't stack bags, man. This is for you. Don't stack them. Trust me.